Got a big Spanish on. <laughs> Anyways. So guys, here we are. We're just gonna cook these fish on the fire. Um, so yeah, cook it in a bit of alcohol, a bit of lemon, wrap it in alcohol and chuck it on the coals when this gets down to coals. So we're gonna light it now. So guys, here we are, we're out here just by the lake, I'm going to gill and gut these fish and take the scars off and we're going to cook them while on the fire, like you saw before, so do a quick time stuff with me and do a how to, and yeah. So guys, here we are um, with this snapper. I'm gonna show you how to gut, gill, or scale. So you just wanna grab a spoon, or if you've got a scaler, and literally just like go back and forth, and all those scales will fly off, making sure to get right up into these, right up into the gills here. I mean the fins, sorry, and all the way back down here. But before. Like sort of I do that, I like to take off all these fins with just some clippers, like because you don't really, you don't eat them unless you're crazy. And it just makes the job like even cooking like so much easier. Cooking and scaling so much easier to scale your fish then. So yeah, just take all these off. But yeah guys if you haven't liked or subscribed make sure to hit that subscribe button and let me know if any videos you want to see in the comments and anything i can improve but yeah just doing this for a bit of fun um yeah so take all them off take this back one off as well So yeah, it's a pretty good day today, but I don't know, it could be better. But yeah, just all those scars. Make sure to get like, go like different angles as well when you get to some bits. Like they're just getting caught up there, so you just come across. Then on the back here, you want to get up along there. What I do is I grab these. They're on um, Black Panthers, they're called. Sterling, silver, I don't know what it is. It just says sterling on it. And you go in through the bum hole here, you can use a knife or whatever, and you just cut all the way up to there, then pretty much just wedge it in there, cut across with the gills, then use your fingers and there's like a bone there, it's, got, it's like connected to the gills, just snap that and pull it apart there, get all your things. And then take that down to the water, give it a clean. And before that though, up here, you've got your gills. So, I probably can't show So guys, welcome to the kitchen. We've got the two snapper here. Um, 
and we're just going to pretty much coat them in two layers of alcohol here, pepper, a bit of barbecue spice, salt and olive oil and the lemon. So one we're going to do a lemony sort of one and one we're just going to do plain fish to get the real flavour of the stuff. So what we're going to do here is dice up a few of this, some of this lemon. So we'll need and that can go away for later. But, um, <laughs> Put these guys on here. All I've got first, quickly, do our splits. So, what you want to do, you want to go on an angle, down like that. it over. You can do that for the other fish as well. And we'll place it or we'll do what we've done on this plate. So we'll just cut out, get our lemon. Cut that in. Uh, if we'll just get a little bit of a little bit of pepper. So gonna we got the barbecue spice, the olive oil, salt and pepper just on this one. Just wrap this one up. So guys, here we've got the fish, we're down at fire now. We spread out all those coals, it's really hot. And we're just gonna chuck these straight onto there. Um, yeah. So we've just spread these coals out and we're just gonna throw this straight onto the coals. Just like that. We cover them. So guys, here we are. This is all of the filleted fish. We had to put these both eskies in the end. We had to grab another one because the ice and all the fish. We just wanted to keep it really compact. So here we have little two little mackerel chunks from the head. Uh, we got four, five or six steaks, and more mackerel here. We got some tusky here, big longy fillets, mac tuna here. That would give them to a mate who apparently likes mac tuna. He'll use them in a curry. We got the shark here, and more mackerel here. So plenty of fish. I'll keep all that. They'll take that, and day well spent. <laughs>